All right, ladies and gents, welcome back to another uh, video on how to get the AutoCAD software for free if you're a student or a teacher, or I would assume if you have a, a student in your family or even a teacher in your family. All right, so here we go. You are going to go to, and by the way, I'm recreating this because my last video, it doesn't seem like the steps line up anymore with the way that the website works. All right, so you're going to go to autodesk.com slash education. And you're going to go to sign in and you're going to do create account you fill out this information I agree create account what's going to happen is they're going to email you uh, something to verify okay so you got to go into your email now and verify your email address and then you'll end up getting to a point where you can now go back to autodesk.com slash education and you can go to sign in and sign in with that account that you just created so let's just say I'm using this is just a dummy email next sign in that'll bring you back to this page now if you go to get products you notice I'm still on autodesk.com slash education uh, it'll say unlock educational access to autodesk products get started we still need to confirm your eligibility for educational access to autodesk products click more or learn more get started so what they're going to want you to do is upload um, an ID card, a student ID card or a teacher ID card. Uh, that way they can actually verify that you are a student or teacher. So you'll see you just double check your information, confirm, it, it'll tell you what school you go to and all that. Um, and then the next step, it'll ask you to upload your file and then they'll check your eligibility. Now my email address is not a uh, at you know, schools.com email address, so that's why it's not reading mine. But you're going to have to use your, for instance, we're in Tom's River Schools. We are at trschools.com. So you guys will have to use that email address. Or if you're in college, you know, you can use at pennstate.edu or whatever it is. Okay. Um, and then, you know, it'll confirm. I think it takes a little bit of time for them to verify that you are a student or teacher. And then you'll go back to autodesk.com slash education for the third time. I'm actually going to switch to my other account now. And I'll probably have to then go to get products again and in there you'll see that you now have access to you should have access to sign in oh sorry it says already have educational access which I do on this email sign in and you'll see that now you get get product underneath whatever software you're looking at there's a bunch of different software so you guys can check out what you want but for us AutoCAD get product uh, you can change what version you want, obviously. I would stick with, if you're one of my students, 18, 19, or 20. 21, there are some changes, and my videos will be a little bit off on those. Um, but those are coming soon. And then the down arrow, you can do install or download. That's up to you, and that'll run you through the download process, and you will be done at that point. And that's it. I appreciate you guys watching, and I will see you in the next video. Later.